Hello, and thank you for watching. My name is Heather Alexandra, and I'm here to talk about a really cool game. I'm often blown away by just how much games can radically change with little tweaks. This is TikTok Bang Bang, a slow-mo shoot'em dodge'em game that's much like Super Hot, made by Dejoban. It's very straightforward. You just have to make it to the goal at the end of the level, avoiding exploding enemies and a gauntlet full of a host of other hazards. Now, TikTok Bang Bang looks very similar to one of their previous titles, the arcade arena shooter Drunken Robot Pornography. They share many common elements. Giant robot titans, a funky looking gun, and bright fresh colors. But even if they look incredibly similar side by side, DRP and TikTok Bang Bang are very different games. This difference is largely predicated on movement. DRP is very empowering, with arenas full of weapon pickups where you zoom from point to point, furiously blasting away at robots. TikTok Bang Bang actually keeps things far less bombastic. You can only be hit once, and you're often just dodging your way through levels. Bit by bit, you make fine movements and small adjustments in order to avoid failure. Much of this comes from changing how the player makes their way through the game space. In TikTok Bang Bang, much like Super Hot, time moves when you move. Talking about the way a game makes you feel is always a tricky proposition. It varies a lot from person to person. For me, TikTok Bang Bang is pretty stressful, even if it is very beautiful. When you move, you have a very clear idea if you've made a mistake or not. Jump too far and you have to slowly watch as your mistakes play out in front of you. Because you're forced to restart after one hit, you become very self-aware. There's a type of performance anxiety that occurs. Even the smallest alterations to movement have huge repercussions. In DRP, your momentum carries slightly before you stop. It feels a bit like you're on roller skates. You're always course correcting in DRP, always reacting to elements that slip out of your control. In TikTok Bang Bang, no such momentum exists. You land on a dime and move exactly when and where you aim to move. If DRP feels like you're dancing furiously in a club, TikTok feels like you're acting out choreography. It's fitting because the game's framing device is that you're a Hollywood stunt woman. It's distinctive and definitely a far cry from DRP's gloriously sloppy gunfights. TikTok Bang Bang's ability to get the most out of everything it has extends far beyond movement as well. It's very good at remixing elements in many different ways. A wonderful example of this are the cars. You'll spend a lot of time dodging cars in TikTok, but the game goes to great lengths to alter your spatial relationship to them. Sometimes it'll hurl a mass of tumbling cars at you like an avalanche. Other times, you'll have to play Frogger. Literally, it makes you play Frogger. And that level is particularly great at showing off how new perspective and mechanics can take an old scenario and imbue it with new and exciting context. Sort of like taking an old recipe, but tossing in a few special ingredients. Games build on each other, and this building allows multiple developers to put their own affectations on certain mechanics or ideas. Superhot's approach to movement was honed into a razor-sharp criticism about player power fantasies. TikTok Bang Bang takes what came before it and turns it into a joyful celebration of video game strangeness. You get to watch all the absurdity play out before you in silly detail. Plenty of this is also conveyed through the visuals. Superhot manages to be very cold and sterile. TikTok has a similar harshness, it uses the same sort of bright aesthetic, but it opens up to give players a bit more room. These differences color the way in which the slow-mo conveys mood, with very different results. It's easy to look at TikTok Bang Bang and see something derivative. To see something that pulls heavily from other titles, both from the same studio and without. But Closer Look reveals a type of iteration, with subtle changes that help define a unique experience. 
It's a sort of video game science project, experimenting with formulas and seeing what it can do to create a new reaction. In games, a little goes a long way, and TikTok Bang Bang definitely goes the distance.